Hi students, uh, today let us learn about rancidity. When fats and oils stay in open for long, they get oxidized and become rancid and their smell and taste change. So usually it is a, a problem faced uh, during summer especially. Uh, that is fats and oils when they are kept in out, that is when they are exposed to atmosphere and because there, there is a very high temperature also, what happens is fats uh, and oils primarily because they are unsaturated carbon atoms ma uh, mainly comprising of double bond or triple bond hence they can easily undergo oxidation so this chemical name is what we call as rancidity now how can we prevent rancidity by adding antioxidants to foods containing fats and oils so primarily the chemicals are nothing but the um, antioxidants natural also antioxidants are present in fruits and vegetables but, but when it comes to fats and oils to reduce the amount of rancidity or prevent rancidity completely there are two chemical uh, compounds that is uh, BHA and BHT butylated hydroxyanisole and butylated hydroxytoline so these two chemicals are added to prevent rancidity so primarily here uh, we can expect addition reaction to take place because um, since I already told you that fats and oils are can be conjugated uh, double triple bond between carbon atoms and these double bonds have to be primarily removed so that's only possible when the, we are adding antioxidants and second is by packing foods in nitrogen gas See, nitrogen gas is a highly unreactive um, non-metal nitrogen and uh, this unreactive uh, nitrogen gas primarily also serves as an antioxidant and prevents rancidity so hence usually whatever when we buy um, packets of uh, chips from the vendors we can observe that they will usually be inflated so this inflation is mainly because they would have um, um, when they're packing they would have just uh, put a lot of nitrogen gas in it third is by refrigeration so whenever temperature is uh, reduced to a certain um, level then also we know that the multiplication of germs reduces and because of this also rancidity can be prevented and of course these days we're having tight containers airtight containers can be glass or it can also be plastic and this also can prevent rancidity and third one is storing food away from light as i already told you light is uh, providing temperature and because of high temperature also fats and oils can taste bad and also that uh, the smell of the oil can also change so these are some of the five basic methods of preventing rancidity now there is a question related to rancidity what are antioxidants why are they added to fat and oil containing foods to prevent rancidity so uh, as already told antioxidants are substances which are added to food to delay or control or even inhibit oxidation and deterioration of food quality if you can also provide two examples bha and bht thank you